Hello everybody, I'm Master Rolfus and welcome to Mission 2 in Ancient Space. So, we're about to start this baby up, but first and foremost, let's check out the fleet. Now, this is where you can take all the ships that are available to you and kind of just upgrade them in between missions. So, we do have some titanium parts that we can go ahead and increase our damage versus medium units or increase our armor over here for our Lancer. And for our Invader, we can increase the damage versus extra large or large ships. And the Rover can essentially just get a speed buff and an extra point in damage versus small targets so you know what i'm going to save up for a rainy day and we might actually get something even better for my lancer or my invader or maybe even something for a completely new ship so that's basically about it currently we only have the medium rover and two small ships the lancer and the invader and afterwards we have a large extra large and i don't even know what the fuck's beyond that i can't wait to see what's uh what's beyond that actually oh right Someone did tell me to move the cursor. The expedition is in trouble. We're in pursuit of the pirates who stole our T cells, and we cannot activate the Hephaestus Gate in the inner zone without them. Paradigm Research Cabinet representatives have rendezvoused with the fleet and are now auditing our actions. I am afraid Dr. Burke's promise of finding new energy resources in the Black Zone may not be enough to prevent them from shutting us down. Commissioner Aaron Renner. Tech Specialist Ama Lin and Dr. Henji Nagata will be joining us to look after PRC interests. Hopefully we can make use of their talents without letting them hinder us. I like Henji Nagata. He has a pretty badass scar. Goes all the way across his, like, eyeball. It's basically the lion from Lion King. The one that, you know, turns evil and kills Mufasa. We oh wait, his name is Star. Down already, Admiral. We can't proceed without the nice auditors from the PRC. PRC personnel transfer underway. Admiral, this is Commissioner Renner of the Paradigm Research Cabinet. I'm at your disposal, of course, but I must object to chasing pirates into unknown space. If the PRC wants to tag along, make yourselves useful and help us get those T-cells back. Of course, Admiral, we're here to assist. You should also be aware, though, that Dr. Nagat is technically not a member of the PRC. Mission parameter update. We must bolster our forces by securing more energy and constructing units. Okay, build up a base. Our stolen T cells are being ferried via convoy to the pirate controlled warp gate in Sector 1. We must intercept and destroy the convoy transport vessels before they warp out of the area. Suggestion Avoid the pirate base in this region if possible. I am detecting heavy defenses. All right, so pretty much the big no-no. All, right. All good. Carriers will be prime enemy targets and must be defended. So pretty much everything's basically simple. All we have to do really is kind of just keep these two alive, and then afterwards build up a strong enough base to attack the pirates. Seems all good. Let's not get caught with okay, let's pause again. the game Initiate a little bit and let's look around the planet. Well, not the planet, the system. Good God, the system. Alrighty then, let's see what do we have in store. We have a bunch of this resource over here, so we have energy and we have, I think this is metal. Hold on a second. I forgot, the tutorial had an actual unique name for this resource. Hydrogen 3? Ah, whatever, fuck it. Oh, um, Dicterium. Tritium? It's right over there. Um, it's really, really small text. I cannot, the life of me, actually pronounce this. Triterium. I, I'm not sure. Whatever. It's basically green shit. So, Vespian gas. Right, and this is the warp area. We could build some turrets over there. I would like to do that. Put some turrets here. Hmm. Okay. Interesting. Interesting stuff. Well, what do we have in store for our enemies? We have two extra large ships, which are the Ulysses and the Olympus. This rover over here. How about this rover? I need you to go ahead and get me resources. I guess the Lancers can just chill out. Oh, we don't have any invaders to start off with? That sucks. Oh, but we actually have two rovers. Okie dokie. Whoa, this is interesting. I guess what I want to do is get out my resources first, and then afterwards we'll move on to getting out some turrets in this area. Okay, good. Now, in order to actually go ahead and build more ships, we have to unlock tech. So I do have to click on T1 or click on T2 in order to actually go ahead and build Lancers and Invaders, as well as Rovers to a lesser extent. 
Huh. What's going on here? Oh, like anomaly. Guess you're scanning that we one. Have discovered something. Oh, good. Okay, these anomalies can be scanned to gain valuable rewards, such as ah, awesome. It's actually really good. So now we're gonna get a little bit more resources. And let's see, the resources are energy, which is basic, which is basic resource for lower tier ships and structures. The um, resource I had trouble pronouncing, Ditrium. Used to purchase enhancements and advanced units and replicants determine the number of units in fleet. Okay, so it's basically kind of like houses. Fair enough. Let me go ahead and secure a station right over here. Or here. God, I... A little bit lost. I don't know which one to do. This one or this one. You know what? I'll do. go ahead and do this one. Why not? Oh, look, pirates. Hello there. Set up my lances on offensive mode and the extra large ships. Can I... Kind of just chill about. Get some lockdown, field repairs, quantum recycling. Oh, this is really damn good, actually. Improves damage on all friendly offensive buildings in the radius. What does this one do? Overlord shield, enemy units in the radius. Okay, pretty good stuff. We have a lot of tools at our disposal. Mission update. We're completely Pirate cracking convoy Ghana's units. Is transporting T cells through warp gate. Next right, convoy launch estimated in five minutes. Let's go ahead and get these stations started up. How you guys doing? Haha, <laughs> guten tag. Pirate scum. I wonder, can I move my carriers with me or would that be a dumb idea? I guess could move them with me. Doesn't hurt. And we should definitely get some. Oh, wait, we already locked T2 and T1 tech. My bad. Okay, so let's just go ahead and probably get out one Lancer. Maybe we can get out two invaders. No, wait, wait. We'll wait to see if they're even going to build cutlasses. Because who knows? Maybe they'll just have a ton of sharks. Uh, I'm going to think positively about this one. Let's see. We can get turret or we can get artillery. This one is effective against large and extra large units. So we'll start our buildings. Okay, let's just get turrets for the time being in our stations. Get artillery over here. Ah, mission complete. Build any unit. God bless. It's an easy mission. Fit for the king. Ooh, I need you guys to go ahead and focus on that ship over there. While our Lancers deal with all the small ships. Not you. Invader construct. Into an invader's, um, not an uh, invader zone, but defensive zone. There we go. These guys should be strong against the Cutlasses, right? Yeah, they are. First and foremost, though. Let me check out something. Invader. Go into defensive formation and go ahead and fire missile barrage. Lost. Ooh, we are losing some Lancers. Probably due to unforeseen consequences. Yep, like more pirate ships. Good god, they're sending in the big guns now. Let me go ahead and actually send in well not send in, build more invaders. Focus fire on that big ship. Target unacceptable. Can I send out another missile silo? Yes I can. Awesome. Come on, guys. I just need you to focus fire on the large ship because my extra large ships should be a okay with defending against this extra large ship over here. Command of the pirates. Hold on a second. Yeah, you do extra damage versus extra large. You mostly do extra damage against bases. Oh well. Fair enough. Now, I guess the biggest loss would be losing a rover. That's pretty much about it. Evader constructed. Everything else is kind of a little bit like eh. You can lose that. Prepare okay, it easily. This is taking heavy damage. What well, is taking heavy damage? Come on now, you're being repaired by the rover. Watch this, bam. Repaired. Okay, my ships are really goddamn weak, so let's go back. Let's get some artillery up in here. Invader constructed. Goddamn, more sharks. It's not looking good. Go ahead and put my guys on defensive mode. 
I guess I'm gonna pull this guy back and push forward my Lancers. Lancer constructed. Ah, we got another Lancer, good. Now these sharks are gonna be easy. Easy pickings. Hmm, is there any way for me to speed this up a little bit? Yeah, two rovers. Price of one, you know what? Oh, good. That should speed things up. Now let's get another station up in here. Probably a turret or two. Not an artillery piece, but definitely like a turret. Where are you, invader? Oh, you're still there. Good. Still struggling to stay alive. <gasps> no, don't die. There we go. Please repair my stuff. Thank you. Actually, we should probably get out of our league because you never know when things are going to be a little bit dicey. A rover would be kind of overkill. Oh, God damn it. Pirates already got themselves set up over here. It's not on a golden opportunity. Let's get both of these uh, sectors all suited up with all manner of gizmos and gadgets. Alright, what are you doing? Killing that guy up. Good. You should just heal the Lancer. And you have nothing to do. I think what you should do is get me that artillery piece right about now. And then after your final job will be that station over there. Which will be probably a turret. I mean, we really don't have any buildings to actually fire at. Can't even fire over there. Look at that. Wait, can we? No. Just out of range. I'd be able to fire at him. Oh, we can't even fire at him. That's that's a shame. Yep, that is a shame. Oh, well. 21 seconds till the next convoy. So we're going to have to... Not enough replicas. Basically, try everything we got. Let's try and kick some ass and shoot some bubblegum. Otherwise, we're going to be in a pretty shitty situation. Ooh, hello there. Officer Roster. Inspire crew. Boost armor on all friendly units. Grants temporary force field. I actually like that. In the to all friendly units in the current sector, or boost damage. I ooh, total war strategy. Okay, I really like full system security and a total war strategy. This completely struck my foes. Warning: first convoy is en route. Right, where? Convoy bearing zero four five closing in. Okay, on the left side. We have a Let's just focus on those T -cells, sir. most of my Let's go get them. military on the left side, right over there. Come on, guys. <laughs> I love how my US uh, UCS Olympus is just chilling about. Like, I'm in space. I wonder, would we have enough turrets for this? Yeah, we probably do. Convoy is going to pass through this area, though, no matter what. Wow. Already in the fight. Thank God we have our invaders on in defensive mode. Thank God we have rovers here. Right, so the Lancers are basically just going to kill everything in sight that's close to them. And right now our, our friendly rover over here, the guy that's basically doing nothing. Kind of just gonna chill about and heal up anybody he can. Right, you guys can go ahead and basically send out some missile salvos on the cutlass. Yeah, there we go. There we fucking go. Bless. Where's that cargo ship? Wait, hold on a second. Let me check it out. He's right over there. So we don't have to worry about him just yet. Soon we will. That extra large ship is going to be a problem. Now, how much damage do you do versus extra large? Eh, quite a bit. Lancers, I need you guys to go ahead and deal with these sharks, actually, because they're going to be a little bit annoying, to say the least. Thank God we have uh, turrets over here. Now then, gentlemen, ladies and germs, attack! Full speed ahead. A couple of missile salvos will be able to send this guy back to the Stone Age. 
No, uh, there we go. Here we fucking go. See you in hell, buddy boy. Are you a turret? Yes, you are a turret. So the artillery piece we built is that. Oh, we didn't even build an artillery piece. Oh, I feel a little bit dumb right now. Good God, I love the song in the background. Like, holy shit, this game has an amazing score to it. Oh, and I can build turrets for these stations. What am, what am I even doing with my life? Can't believe I forgot about that. It's a shame we can't get any more replicants. Actually, we could build a war factory. Oh, oh shit, that was an ability. God damn it, I feel really dumb. Oh, cargo ship, how you doing? Get ready for the butt kicking of your life. In fact, can we send in my units right now? Let's see, what does he have? Artillery, uh, turret, turret. Oh, wait, just nothing over there. You know what? We'll wait till he gets halfway. Who the hell do you think you are coming in here, barging in like you own the place, huh? Invaders, you know what to do. Get into position while our lancers basically get the crap out of these sharks. Alright then. Attack the cargo ship. Go, 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 go. Attack it with everything you got. Oh, they basically left this thing all exposed. That's weird. Admiral units report one cargo container retrieved. Move to the next. Alright, so the next one would be on the right side, correct? Probably. Where is it coming from? Or maybe it's just like, yeah, it, it's probably still loading up. It's gonna take one minute. But basically, it should be on this right side over here. If everything goes according to plan. Where is he sending his forces? Ooh, they're actually coming on the left side. That's weird. Well, we have a bunch of ships here that are ready to basically go in hot in case he has anything to say about that. Yeah, well, let's bring in our, our entire Navy back. To the front lines. Come on. Come on. No point in leaving you all alone. You know, I feel like probably the invaders could do all the dirty work. They really can. You know what? I don't even care if this has nothing to do with space. I love Ja. Super. See, I'm really waiting to use my commanders for a rainy day. Because I feel like I don't really need them. Oh, Rover, you're such a doll. Killing up my guys. Artillery, you know what to do. I hope you know what to do. The missile salvos are about to go out on these fools. Dude, you hardly use your missile salvos. Unless you weren't actually a invader. Just a possibility. Well, that basically dealt with him. We're building another invader right about now. Second convoy is on. Hello there. They'll try to throw us off. Watch for decoys. Yikes. They're trying to take us out over here. That's a little bit bad. Oh, but we have a bunch of turrets here. Yeah, that should be easy to defend. Okay, so there are decoy convoys. Let's see. Is that one the real one? Probably, right? I mean, it has to be. Man of War is coming in. Coming in hot. Here, Olympus and a couple of you invaders. Come with me. Time we go ahead and show them who's boss. And by the way, you need to get into defensive mode. That's good. Hey, hey, buddy. Buddy, buddy, buddy. Fire missile salvos. Everybody fire missile salvos. Station boss. There we go. Ah, oh, crap. I thought you could have actually been able to deal with that. 
Oh, here's me overestimating my turrets. Ah, oh, well, we have a ton of resources. In fact, he gets, if he gets a little bit closer to my base of operations, I will just destroy him. Oh, artillery, why must you have such a low range? Okay, turret, you can just focus on that shark over there. Good. And now the invaders can deal with the pirates. Are the pirates humans? Yeah, they're, they're probably humans, right? What else could they be? Not aliens. That would be really cool, though. Because I feel like there's a distinct lack of aliens in this game. So then again, we are only like, what? 20 minutes in? Alrighty then, you're out of the club. Cooklitz Club. We do have a couple Third cutlasses. Is en route. Ah, that's their game. Alright, we'll play your game. I do like a game of chess or checkers. Ooh, you're actually coming in on Invaded. the left side. Lost. Interesting. Well, if you're coming in on the left side and you're coming in on the right side, one of you has to be the decoy. It seems like these guys are a little bit stronger than I assumed. Yeah, we're out of missile salvos, actually, that's why. It a little bit high. Kinda suck. Alright, pull back. Pull back. Okay, how far away are you? Ah, not too far away. We have turrets over here that can slow down those fools. Let's go ahead and rebuild our... Invader army so to speak and you know what Lancers and Ulysses can move forward while my invaders as well as the mighty Olympus can move back try to defend our lands Invader constructed. Well, not our lands but our territories against these cutlasses over here because these things are gonna be a little bit deadly I mean, yeah, we, we should probably pull back the Lancers, but I think it's all fine. Lancer constructed. Also, we could just kind of pull back a Lancer over here, and one Lancer is pretty much equal to that of, like, three Sharks. It's absolutely insane. Okay, you're basically dead. Convoy is basically dead over here. Oh, by the way, uh, build an uh, artillery. Here. Decoy. I told you. Rush it off. Station over there, the and let's move on to the convoy to the left side. God damn it, I can't believe we fell for that decoy. Come on guys, we'll get you guys in the game. Yeah, we're gonna need some way to figure out how to tell these decoys apart in a little bit more of an effective manner. Maybe if they have like holy cutlasses, we just back off. That's a little bit fishy to be honest. Holy cutlasses. All right, I'm sending in my Olympus over here to deal with these cutlasses. I'll go over, heal him up, and we'll have the Lancers deal with the fighters. And the invaders could basically just deal with the might of this army over here. Wait, wait, I need you to go into defensive formation. That's lost. Well, we were going to lose our lancers. It's just Lance inevitable. Loss. Yeah, let's pull back a little bit. Seems like we're losing more units than we should. But that's fine. He has, like, direct handers to my guys. The artillery should be okay. Yeah, that's it's basically all, all ogre for this guy. Can't deal with my artillery, man. Just can't deal with it. Too powerful for you. Too strong. Invader constructed. All right, invaders, get to ready. They're all healed up, good. Go ahead and put them in defensive formation, and then they can use their missile salvos to destroy their enemies. And let's also go ahead and target that convoy. Yeah, leading them into my turret line was actually pretty damn good. Just look at this, they're getting completely destroyed. 
Bam, son. Where'd you find that? Warning. Fourth and fifth convoys are en route. Get us in right. attack range. We'll take them back one at a time. Seriously, two at the same time? It's like a goddamn Whopper Jr. Stacked up with a big king. Holy moly, I'm looking at that fleet right now. It's not looking good. No, I don't think they're here to say hi. Oh, come on, guys. Let's go ahead and focus fire on that convoy really fast. Ooh, that's not looking good. You get over there straight away. And Lancers, we're going to need you. Ulysses 2 is taking heavy damage. Yeah, you guys are taking way, way too much damage over there. Where's my rover? There we go. We rover, heal up. Today won't be a loss. Where's my other rover? He might have died. Yeah, that kind of sucks. Well, let's go ahead and build him, I guess. Him stronger, better than he would ever was. To a god. A machine of war. Okay. Time now to pull back. Yikes. This guy is all but dead at this point. Okay, how's everything going on this side? We're gonna expect some forces here. I guess the left side is a little bit more important because he does have a man of war. Though he's also sending in a man of war on the right side. I mean, all we have to do is retrieve one more T cell, then we win. But letting one cargo ship go by is gonna be a massive loss. You can maybe use total war strategy. Try to speed up the destruction of that cargo ship. That could work. All I know is that right about now, I need to build up another rover. Heal up my guys a little bit. Because they are super, super weak. We'd like to see if we can maybe, like... I don't know. Target out of range. Maybe upgrade on my turrets, but I can't. The units I have are the units I have. I should probably use my abilities a little bit more. Ah, like that one. Yeah, that's actually a really, really useful ability. Oh my god, I can't believe I haven't used that before. What the hell? Okay, with one artillery and one turret, I think we should be fine. Especially with the units he's setting in. But then again, I always think we should be fine. Uh, I'm always thinking about the positives. Is that so bad? Is that so wrong? Okay, attacking those turrets is basically suicidal, so I'm not going to do that. Let me go ahead and pull the, Ulyss uh, the Olympus over there. Lancers, you can pull back and go to the right side. No point in you staying there. So far, so good. You can just stay over there. You have tons and tons of units to back you up. Yeah, there we go. Man of War is basically kaput. Oh, well, uh, there's tons of units there. Thank God we've already started our great journey. Yeah, time to use the dash. One dash over there, swiggity swiggity. And these units are all that we need to take out this cargo ship. I, I assume. <laughs> yeah, I don't know, maybe we might need a little bit more here, maybe a little bit more there. Who knows, maybe they might send in like a super, I don't know, Death Star like weapon of destruction and mayhem. Basically, one shot to all of our units. It could happen. Alright, then, so invaders are basically all done with this unit. Let me go back and pull out my lancers for the time being. Really, the only units that should be fighting right about now are the invaders. Oh no, please don't do that. Invader lost. Yeah, we lost an invader too. Oh, that guy. Well, that's that's acceptable. Ooh. 
Keep the firepower strong, lads. Good god, that's a lot of firepower coming in. Hmm, let's see, what abilities do we have? We lost the first convoy, they're through the gate. Really? Whoa. We did? Shit. Oh wait, no we didn't. Hold on a sec. I'm getting a little bit confused. Hmm. Convoy's right over there. I'm a little bit perplexed right about now. Might have been something else, I don't know. Whatever, let's focus on this man of war right about now. Let's focus on the man of war. You're basically dying. There's no way getting around that fact, okay? Cargo units retrieved. Finally. Thank God. Awesome. We got everything we need. What is that? A discovery? Oh shit, that's a discovery. Hold on a second. Rover. Incoming you know what I need. Hostiles. I guess they really want those T cells. Yeah, no, really this do. is retaliation. Concentrate defense on Ulysses and Olympus. Oh shit. Are they really gonna try and attack Ulysses Admiral and Olympus? Farnsen that kinda deplete. sucks. Clear all remaining hostiles. Lieutenant Tracy, did you track where they took the T cells? The destination traces to Redwater Bay. I must point out that is not a safe place. Redwater to go. Bay. Commissioner, with all due respect, let us do our jobs. Redwater Bay. You know what? That actually looks that actually sounds like a really cool name to be honest. Like Redwater Bay. It's like a restaurant, you know, off the banks of Milan. Anyway, so have hazardly constructed but relatively sturdy pirate cruisers. Pretty good against the extra large units and buildings. Ah, no wonder why they did so much damage against my Olympus. Poor Olympus. Well, invaders, I just need you to hold back. Well, it's just you can probably move forward. We have made a discovery. Oh, crap. That kind of sucks. No goodies. Well, no goodies is in, like, more population. There is another discovery here? Like, hold on a minute. Wait a minute. Yeah, there is one more here, but I'm not sure if the Turk can hit us. There's one over there. I guess we can check that area out. Right, continue the pain train. And fire here. Okay, good. Now, invaders, just need to hold back. Hold back as much as you can. Hover's still alive? Yeah, he's still alive. He's still kicking, rocking out. Make this ship invulnerable? No, no, no. I don't want to do that. I do probably want to do this. Put my guys a little bit. On the go. Lance oh. Lost. Lancers. Both of them were lost. That kind of sucks. I like how the difficulty ramp up, ramps up to this game quite a bit. Because usually it's, it's a really easy game, to be honest. Especially when you learn all the controls. Target unacceptable. Okay, Rover, I need you to repair that turret because that's the only way for us to effectively kill those fighters. Wow, they are setting in the horde. Get two more Lancers prepared uh, to replace the ones that we lost. It's a shame our larger ships kind of suck massive dong at killing these fighters. Except for the Olympus. Olympus is pretty good. Lancer constructed. Okay, you guys go ahead and protect our right flank. Ooh, that is another man of war. So let's go ahead and back off a little bit. And we should probably focus fire on Lancer that guy. Constructed. Yep, come on, come on. Focus, focus. Is taking let's see, damage. improves damage of all. You know what? Let's use this guy. Target unacceptable. Right, come on, everybody. I need super damage up in here. Take that. Savage down. Take him down. Where you can pull back. Olympus, hold on strong. Yes, yes, yes. Let's see. Grand's forces a temporary 
field. I would actually like that. Yeah, I would really, really prefer that we do that. <clears throat> Let's see. Invader lost. Okay, go ahead and pull back right about now. Keep the Olympus alive, chaps. Keep the Olympus alive. As long as we keep that baby alive, we should be fine. Wait, where's my second rope? Where are you? Okay, you're you're healing up that guy. Good. Make the ship virtually invulnerable in exchange for some of its firepower. You know what? I actually like that. Go ahead and do that. Now we can focus our rovers on basically healing up the Olympus. Now I'm going to see oh, this guy. Just going to wait for the right time to use him because granting a temporary force field on all of our units is pretty damn big. Shame there's so many large ships. Yeah, we're going to need more invaders. Here, go ahead and change off offensive capabilities to make my guys a little bit tankier. Good, 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 good. You cannot stand up to my might. Hold on a second. Who else is on offensive? Yeah, go on. Regular mode. Lancer constructed. Okay, good. I love the pause option. It really makes things a lot more useful. I mean, well, not a lot more useful, but a lot more easier. And then send them to hell. There we go. Okay, with both of the extra large ships now dealt with. Now we can probably move on to probably this side. Yeah, there we go. And we're gonna have the Olympus go back and deal with these large ships. Station lost. Yeah, this one, right? Yep. That's unfortunate. Oh well, artillery pieces here. False havoc. Bam! Send you straight to hell, my friends. Hmm, I'm gonna pull you back. Just a tad. Just a tad. Oh crap, Lancers, please. Please, Lancers, no. You pleb. HEMO? Why not? Oh, oh, wait, wait, wait. HEMO improves my stations. Yeah, we can go ahead and use them on the turret, I guess. Because we don't have much in the way of anti-fighter weaponry. Okay, come on, folks, fire on the Man of War. Send all of your missiles into its buttocks. Oh, shit, they're still setting in forces. Look at that. That's a wave of them. A conga line of death, if you would like to call it that. Let's see, see up, my guys. Everybody in the area should be killed up. It's the, the right thing to do, I guess. Oh, yes. The beautiful explosions. Okay, so I guess now we can put my guys on pursue mode or offensive mode. So at this point, I mean, just a bunch of fighters. Why not? Oh crap, we're gonna Lance lose that Lancer. Lost. Yeah, there were just way too many dudes. We didn't have any backup from this Lancer. Well, it's not that Lancer's fault. I guess I was just a little bit lazy. Alright, pretty good stuff. Yeah. We kicked some this pirate boy booty. Seems unstable. Last coordinates were Redwater Bay. But there's a problem. Admiral, I'm reading a large mass in there. <laughs> Holy moly. So, was that the alien ship? Well, I guess we'll figure it out in the next mission. So let's see what we got. We got alien mold. Oh, occasionally getting a little bit more income and stuff, getting a little bit more energy from the magnetic highway vessel. God damn, we should have explored more discoveries. There were actually a lot of discoveries we could have actually unlocked. My bad. Oh well, 
I will see you guys next time for the next mission. Bye-bye.